Foreclosures affect the poor as well as the rich. Unfortunately, these situations do happen and some people don't know where to turn. One 26-year-old entrepreneur has taken the challenge to help 100 families facing foreclosures in 100 days. He's helping families in New Jersey, New York, and Philadelphia. We just wanted to make a statement that people have options. Uh, we kind of wanted to make it a call to action for people, let them know that there's help out there. We put all the resources in one place for people to be able to get out of foreclosure by walking away from the house on a short sale at no cost to them. This may sound way too easy, but Paul is out to help, and he has arranged to help these families every step of the way. We're going to give them everything they need, free legal advice, uh, free real estate and brokerage services. We're going to be handling the short sale for them, and it's going to be all at no cost to them. Anybody is eligible for this help, no matter where they live or what their home looks like. Anybody who's behind on payments on a house, uh, wants to sell their house, or they have too much debt on the property and they want to just wipe the slate clean and get a fresh start. We've seen everything from houses in war zones to multi-million dollar houses in the most expensive neighborhoods. So the biggest thing is uh, everybody goes through financial hardship. It's not, it's uh, a lot of times it's very hardworking people just the wrong things happened and uh, now they need to somehow settle on the house. There are many people working with Paul on this project who can help you. But the first step is to apply by logging on to 100familychallenge.org and filling out the application to be on the wait list. When you are approved, you will speak with a lawyer and a real estate broker. I meet them at the house, okay? Um, I discuss why they need to sell the home. Um, are they really qualified or is it a hardship or whatever? And then what is, what is the value of the home? My, my, the biggest job I have is to price the house so I get an offer on it, but not to price it too low because then the bank will reject it. They're going to say it's a low offer. So it's got to be, you have to just price it just right for the current market. They have even found that in some situations, the bank will pay the homeowners. Biggest incentive is sometimes the bank will actually pay homeowners to move out of the house anywhere between three to $20,000. It's not guaranteed. It depends on the situation, but it's definitely a nice incentive to start over. The incentive for this challenge lies in Paul's past. He was brought here by his mother from Russia at the age of four. We escaped from Russia, and I noticed a lot of the other people that came over with us years down the line, they're not really in a good position financially uh, or socially just because they got the wrong advice you know, when they didn't know what all their options were. So a lot of times, especially uh, people that didn't understand the documents they were signing when they were buying the house, Right now, they're in danger again without knowing what their options are. If you or anyone you know is in danger of foreclosure, Paul may be able to help. He says the light at the end of the tunnel lies in this stack of papers, which states that the bank actually gives you permission to walk away from the home. This stack is over 100 short sale approval letters, and he says you can be next. He will be helping people in New Jersey, New York, and Philadelphia, and all you have to do is call 609 Two six nine four nine nine nine, or log on to www. dot one hundred family challenge. dot org and fill out the application. But remember, it doesn't matter where you live or what shape your home is in. He may be able to help you. Reporting in Trenton, Rose Eckler, WZBN News.